Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. It's Monday after Thanksgiving, and if you're anything like me, honey, you are tired of turkey sandwiches. <laughs> yeah. I mean, mayonnaise, and you put everything on it, just too much. I'm just over it. Lettuce, little okay. tomato. Exactly. Just a little bit. But here's the deal. We have our celebrity chef, Cam, here, hey, who's going to tell us what can we do with all of those Leftovers. We can spice them up. We can spice them up. Because you know we like up. a little spice. Yes, like we do. Like a little do. spice in that waist. Because I, I see you. Oh, thank you, you baby. You're looking real good, baby <laughs> thank girl. You. I'm so thankful for you. Mm, I love you, So the first thing that baby. we are going to do, everyone, is a jerk turkey egg roll. Oh, that's good. You know, I'm from Chicago, and we jerk everything. We jerk an arm, jerk a foot, jerk a weed. <laughs> Every, everything is jerked, OK? They just love, love a good it, jerk. I love it. So, so what, are, what ingredients do we have so here, So we Cam? have some turkey leftovers, some shavings. You know, the juicy part. I like to use the dark meat. Because, you know, some people try to push it away, but it's juicy. Got a lot of flavor. So we can just take some of that and throw it right in the okay, bowl. Okay, all right. And um, some slaw, or you know, if you have any greens that are left over, traditionally some people will use a cabbage slaw. Okay. But I traditionally like to use a kale slaw because it gives a, a lot more um, flavor. Okay. It gives it a little bit less of a crunch and gives a little bit more texture. We'll, we'll hold that for the actually okay. the next row. Now, let me ask you. Yes. So I, I had, I, I still have some uh, cabbage left over. A little over. cabbage. You uh -huh. can, you can use, little, use that. You can use cabbage. Traditionally, what we would use is cabbage. Okay. Um, but I wanted to go with just something different, you know, to add something different than what we're used to. You okay, know, it's always crunch. good to ease it up. And what type of spices and seasons? So we have, have some, some jerk spices and seasons. I know you like a lot of spice. So I, I do. Added, I love see that spice. little red Everyone on top? I added that. a little bit of extra Ca cayenne, cayenne, you know, because I know you like a little extra cayenne. So we're going to season that with some cumin, some mm -hmm. brown brown sugar. Okay. We got a little bit of nutmeg in there, and then we got some secret spices that I can't tell you okay, about. Okay, well, don't tell And the then people. we got a little bit of garlic. We'll mm -hmm. mix that in right really okay. easily. And this is what is called a hot ASS sauce. Oh, is that what it's called? Yeah, that's exactly what they call it. Right. You know, that, that's really what's on the front of the bottle? It is. That's what's My on God, the front of the bottle. You got that from New Orleans. <laughs> I did. I'm <laughs> sure you did. And then a little lime juice to add just a little bit of mix of flavor in there. Okay. And then we could go ahead and start rolling that right on up. And it goes literally just like that, right into it, really easy. Okay. All of these are items that we have left over. You okay. want to use, I'm going to use my hands because I have on gloves. But okay, go ahead. We would go with about um, a teaspoon. I mean, about a tablespoon of it, mm -hmm. and then we just want to wipe those edges. Okay. So it's imperative to get a little and bit I just of water, have water here. a little bit of water on each edge because this is going to yield as the barrier to keep all of the contents on the inside. And we don't want it on we the outside. We don't want it on the outside. Some things we want on the outside, but we don't want the, we the don't inside want it of bust. the egg roll. We yeah. don't want it to bust like a can of biscuits. <laughs> <laughs> okay, like I understand. There biscuits. we go. So then, what we want to do is just fold the ends in mm -hmm. like burrito style mm -hmm. and roll. Fold, Literally. Fold and roll. And then get you a little bit of dab on Here the end. Go. And you want to press, guys. You want to make sure you press so that it's perfectly. And it You adheres. can roll it. Yep, right. it adheres. And you drop it right into a deep fryer, okay. preheat it. And how long would you let this cook Typically for? about three to five minutes. Uh -huh. But since we're on TV, you know, we have some done. Okay, but I'm going to let it just sit in there for about three to five minutes. Okay, And then I we can that. move on to the soul roll. Well, let's go to the other one. So okay. a soul roll. Soul roul. roll. Add here. a roll with some soul. I like that. <laughs> and so this one is going to be a little bit more sweeter. Yes. Just for, um, this is more like for dessert. You know, if you want to use some of those things that are left over, you don't want to throw them away, mm -hmm. we'll use this as like a snack for lunch or dinner. But okay. then we could go ahead and use some of our candy yams. Okay. And then we have some gourmet five cheese mac and cheese that we have left as okay. well. Now that is a sweet potato, right? Yes, a sweet potato for anybody that doesn't know what a candy yam is, just basically a sweet, sweet potato. Sweet potato. Okay. It. So but we're going like to say candy, candy yams. yams. You know how we do down in the South. So then we'll take some of our leftover mac and mm -hmm. cheese as well. Mm -hmm. And it's just like that. You just add it right in the same way. Okay. And you any get seasonings, any spices? No, this, you leave this exactly how it is because you already have the it, seasonings, the cinnamon, yeah, the nutmeg, the, the brown the, sugar, um, and the syrup in your yams. yam. And then you already have the cheese and your salt and your garlic. Whatever is in your mac and cheese, okay. it'll be the perfect balance because well, everything go ahead you want it to be down. perfectly balanced. And all you have to do is brush it right down for me. Okay. Oh, I love the way you brush that. You know, honey. How I you am, learn how to brush like that? I'm very gentle. You're very gentle with <laughs> All right, did thing. Okay, yeah. and then I'm gonna roll it, but I have to be soft because I've heard that I could be a little rough. But yes, honey. We, we, don't, we wanna make sure it's child. rough today. But hey. listen, so what are some others? Hello, ladies. Hey, Hello, ladies. How y'all doing? So, tell us what 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 will these be good partnered with? So for me, it's a little heavy. Hey, Miss hey, Trina. Hey, Rashawn. Hey, hey, so you have the egg roll, and mm -hmm. then you have the ingredients. You wanna have something that will cut that down. Right. But you wanna make sure it's something that's still healthy and something that keeps you going. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I like to pair anytime I do something and fry it with the beer. And I know you ladies are, are beer kind of suicide. I might need to watch what I say. But I like to partner with either a rosé cider Ooh, or nice. um, a very hoppy rose IPA that kind of has a little floral accent it's, because what it does is it takes that heaviness 
is from that egg roll. Mm -hmm. And this right here is going to be the, the, the rosé cider. Okay. And then taste. which one oh, you want to try? This is a nice cloudy this is IPA. The IPA. Yes. Nice and one filter. You want to do the IPA or you want to no, do the cider? No, she's not like the You want to do the cider? Yeah, the cider. So what this does? And then can we go ahead and get the taste of the cocktail? I'm going to taste the cocktail. You guys taste the rose. Okay. And I got one right here. This is what you call the soul roll, mm -hmm. Miss Trina. This is if you so want to go ahead and so get a piece of that, us. of course. Amazing to have you always Thank you. for everything that Chef Cam is doing. You want to follow him at <laughs> cooking with me, cooking, not with Miss Quad, <laughs> <laughs> with Chef Cam. <laughs> <It's okay. laughs> oh my gosh. It's on okay. all social media platforms. Ooh. We, my dear, Ooh. will be right back. And Ooh. I'm going to have a little bit more of this. Ooh. Cheers, Cam. Cheers. Chef so Cam, good. everyone. It's delicious.